Hi, my name's Deb. I'm a physiotherapist from Move Better for Life. And today I'm talking to you about diabetes, particularly diabetes type 2 and exercise. Generally, diabetes is a metabolic disease where the body is either unable to produce enough insulin or is unable to use it effectively. Insulin is a hormone that is released into the bloodstream after eating and transports sugar from the food we've eaten into our cells to be used as energy. So without enough insulin, you may have too much sugar running around your bloodstream and that's called hyperglycemia. The body doesn't cope very well with too much sugar, so it is good for it to be managed. If unmanaged, diabetes can have serious short-term and long-term health complications, such as gaining a lot of weight, kidney disease, heart disease, stroke, diabetic-related blindness, insulin injection dependence, and in extreme cases, necrosis of the tissues. The good news is that by adjusting the foods we eat and the amount of exercise you do, type 2 diabetes can be managed effectively in many cases and can help reduce the amount of medication that you're on. The World Health Organization recommends that people with type 2 diabetes complete aerobic exercise at least three to five times per week and strength training at least two times per week at a moderate intensity for up to 30 to 60 minutes per day. Some of the risks associated with exercise for diabetics um, do exist and it is so it's recommended that before you start on an exercise program that you go and see your doctor just to be checked out or you can come and see your exercise physiologist to get a, um, a program that will help you work through it. So thanks for listening. Um, I hope that's given you something to, um, to work on and work towards if you have type 2 diabetes. Thanks very much.